I'm here because I am a roaring lion crying out righteousness. Kamala Harris looks like she's gonna wrap up the nomination. She, I, I understand from reports on last evening that she's already got enough delegates now to go to Chicago in August and uh, there'll be nobody contending with it. Nobody's raised their hand. I think Joe Manchin from down there in West Virginia, Elizabeth says he never tells the truth about anything. Joe Manchin from down there in West Virginia act like he was getting ready to raise his hand on one of the talk shows on Sunday morning. Somebody called, somebody must have called that boy and told him, have you lost your mind? You can go tell you going to run against Kamala. You got, you about to got your mind. So he backed down two hours later. He was back, he was backtracking like a, like a backtracker. But at any rate, so Kamala looks like she's in like Flint and uh, she's all excited. Everybody seemed to be very excited about her. And uh, she, um, made a big speech yesterday up in Delaware where there's the Biden head campaign headquarters in Delaware. So she and her husband, Doug Emhoff, flew up there from Washington, D.C., a 90-mile flight on a great big old 747 airplane. At any rate, uh, she had a speech yesterday, and she was, you know, thanking everybody, thanking Joe and Jill. I think that uh, 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 President Biden's name is Joe. His wife's name is Jill. So I made a little song. Joe and Jill went up the hill to fetch the presidency. Joe fell down and broke his crown and gave it to Camilla. Joe and Jill went up the hill to fetch the presidency. Joe fell down and broke his crown and gave it to Camilla. Joe and Jill went up the hill to fetch the presidency. Joe fell down and broke his crown and gave it to Kamala. 